I'm Mirwan Rani of Chai Pani, and this is my vegetable pilau. Step number one, always wash your rice. Washing it gets rid of the starches. You can just fill this water, agitate it, pour the water out and do it three times. It's two cups of rice, I'm gonna put four cups of water in this and let it just sit for a minute. So in this instant pot, the rice will actually cook in roughly three minutes and then it'll rest for about 10 or 12 minutes and the rice will be done. So I'm gonna turn this thing onto saute. I'm using ghee. Ghee is clarified butter. So we're adding about a half a cup of ghee. Spices, cinnamon, green cardamom pods. We're gonna put a few of those in there. Star anise. This has a really lovely floral nut to it. Three or four cloves. This is something really cool. It's called black cardamom. It adds a little smokiness to the whole dish. And that's it. While that's sizzling, I'm gonna go ahead and dump in ginger, garlic, and green chilies. So we're just gonna saute this in about two, three minutes. We're not trying to fry the ginger and the garlic. We're just trying to cut the rawness off. So potatoes, green beans are cut about an inch. Carrots, bell pepper, and the peas. In that goes. We're not trying to cook the vegetables in the oil right now. We're just trying to make sure that the oil that is flavored with the ginger, with the garlic, the cardamom, the cinnamon coats all the vegetable. I'm going to turn the saute function off. So let's start with the rice. And it goes. Stir it all well together so that the spices, the vegetables, everything gets incorporated nicely. Just a tablespoon and a half of salt, a big healthy pinch and a small and healthy pinch. I like black pepper, I love it. We're gonna to to add that to this dish. Garam masala. Garam masala is essentially the ground up version of the spices that we put in whole. So in that goes. Okay, let's go to the pressure cook and set this thing for three minutes and it should start automatically and we have done it. Now we're gonna let physics, time and pressure take care of the rest. Alrighty, rice is finished. And then we're gonna just check to make sure all the pressure is released. Ta-da! Oh man, that looks pretty damn good. So there you have it. Looks great as a standalone dish or as a complement to anything else on the table. Try this, hope you like it.